I've been in a lot of big equipment taking care of agriculture projects all across the state. Think of the tractor cabs and the combines and the row gators. Well, those are only good when the soil's right, but what about when the conditions aren't right to get into the field? You go over it. Stan Sayer is my guest, and uh, right behind us is his helicopter that we're going to be learning more about here at Sunrise Cooperative in uh, South Charleston. How many hours do you have? I need to ask that first. I'm going to hop in with you here in a little bit. Uh, total hours? Yeah. Well, I don't if you can't I, count them, that's okay. I, yeah, I can't count. Them. I tell you, I got about 44 <laughs> years in them, and we're surpassed probably 20,000 hours. Those might have seen the video of Joel Penorwood uh, up in that uh, plane with Mr. Fisher a couple of months ago, and now it's my turn to have a little bit of fun, but this time in a chopper. Tell me, what's the difference? Well, uh, basically, we can uh, get into the smaller fields a lot more economical than they can. We can wrap up the corners and. They are got their speed of about 100 and probably 40, 150 knots, and we're running about 50 to 60 knots. And so we got a little better control with that kind of stuff. But I would assume at the, at the big fields, they do a little, can keep right up with as far as that. Or their cost factor is cheaper as far as operating costs. So we have to kind of accommodate ourselves with, the, with these, these companies like that to keep our costs down. And they, they, they do all the, the paperwork for us to get us started. And, get everything routed so I always find myself in unique situations like this one but uh, this isn't what you're you know, we're not doing anything for real this is a demonstration and that's the only reason I'm allowed to go up with you that is correct under the under the FAA laws we're not allowed to haul anybody if we're dispersing chemical or anything so for today's purposes we will we'll, it'll be a demonstration and we'll only probably be performing with water the thing's got seat belts right that is correct got okay. five point harness proposal. then I'm ready to go let's hit it <laughs> it sounds like winter why'd you get into this business uh, because, uh, like I said, we was in the potato business, and I had a guy doing my work, and it, it did, uh, he lost, I lost a crop over. So you got your own helicopter and took matters into your own hands? Yes, sir. And how many years now? 44 years 40, I've been in it. You ever get sick of this? Uh, not really. I can't, I can't see how. <laughs> okay, I'm going to pick it up right now.
with age. You start, you start not taking so many chances. But as they say, I live for tomorrow, so uh, I've made it 40-some years, so I must have done something right. Some people look at you as cowboys, but we're really not. We're very professional. We know, you know, we know our capabilities. We know what the machine's capable of doing. We have been in agriculture in this, on the row crop side, the fungicide craze about a decade now. It started out with airplanes, but what a thrill here riding this chopper. Uh, this is kind of where it's going, isn't it? Absolutely. Uh, real excited to, to have you here today and, and uh, help us showcase the benefits of the chopper. I mean, 10 years ago we started, you know, the fungicide craze, 10 or 12 now probably. You know, everybody jumped in uh, kind of lightly, you know, treading water, just trying it out, see what happened. and. Uh, you know, for us, we were we were happy with with the results from an airplane, but uh, at, at some point we felt like we were weren't just quite getting what we needed, and uh, the results were maybe a little disappointing at times. So, got acquainted with uh, with the choppers and uh, been using them now for about 10 years, and frankly, just feel like we're doing, getting a better job. You say it's you know? just a matter of, of quality over quantity. Absolutely. Um, you know, we're asking the growers to to invest in a program, and we want to make sure. We return it to them, and we're, we're definitely getting, we feel, better coverage. Uh, and for us, at Sunrise, it's all about quality. Uh, I'm sure we want to get a lot done in a day, but, but quantity doesn't mean as much as quality to us here. Aaron, thank you very much for the opportunity to be here. Really a fun day. Yeah, absolutely. Glad you came and uh, ex excited to, uh, to showcase what we're doing, so appreciate it. At Sunrise Cooperative in South Charleston, I'm Ty Higgins on the Ohio Agnet. We'll see you down the road.